In this tutorial, we're going to walk through the process of configuring your Outlook for your desktop. First, I'm going to go to my Start menu, and then I'm just going to start typing Outlook 2016. And here it is. It'll automatically appear. So I'm going to access Outlook 2016, the desktop version. And when I do that, it's going to walk through the configuration process. And it will be an automatic wizard that will completely walk me through all of the steps that I need to set up my HCPS email um, from the desktop version. So I'm going to select the next button. Um, it wants me to connect to an email address. I'm going to say yes and next. It will automatically populate my email account based on how I am logged into the computer. So it will pre-populate all of this information for you. Once it does, you can say next, and then it's going to walk through the process of automatically configuring your Outlook mailbox. Next, it's going to prompt for me to provide my network password. Um, so it automatically gives me my organizational account, which is my username at hcps.org, and then it's prompting me to um, add in my network password. And then I'm going to select Remember My Credentials and OK, and it will continue through the process. When I receive the congratulations message, then I know that my account has been configured successfully and is ready to use. So I'm going to select finish. It will load my profile and then it will load my mailbox, including um, all of my emails and any folders that I have already set up. So as you can see, it's dropped me right into my inbox where I have um, all of my email and then I also have any of the folders that I have created um, and they come through. Um, it might take a moment um, for it to go through the updating process um, just to pull in anything uh, that was already in my mailbox. Um, it just takes a little while sometimes for it to pull it down, um, but if you don't have a 10 in your email, then it should be a pretty quick process. And then from here, you're ready to go. Now, one of the next things that we need to consider is if I close out my inbox um, or close out my, my mailbox, I don't have a quick access to it. So one of the things that we would suggest that you would do is if I go back to my start menu and remember we just started typing Outlook and here it comes up again and if I right click on it this time, so I'm going to do a right click and I have the ability to pin it to my taskbar. So when I say pin to taskbar, notice a little icon for Outlook came up here and I now have quick access to my email by just clicking that button. So every morning when I come in, I can um, quickly go to my email um, without having to navigate either out to the portal or even going through the start menu to find the Outlook program. It's easily accessible for me right from my taskbar.